One thing I would like to add, just at the very end, just before I finish, about Claire, is that anyone who has a daughter will back me up when I say this. Very soon after your daughter is born, and much sooner than you think, you do start to think about this day, her wedding day. You imagine who and where she'll marry, what will she look like, what will he look like? Etc. <laughs> Etc. Et like Claire, let me tell you that absolutely nothing I could think of over the years could ever compare to how this day has actually turned out. Genesis and Claire, by coming here today, you have taken the initial step in what will be a wonderful and lasting life together. A union between two people takes effort and a relationship is never complete. It is a process and a journey which requires constant nurturing. A good marriage is one that fosters respect, a devoted love, a willingness to make sacrifices whilst remaining true to your values and convictions. Jen is one of the nicest people you're ever likely to meet. He's certainly one of the nicest people I've ever met, and he, are Claire, he and Claire are perfectly matched for one another. He's been considered one of the family for some time, and I'm proud and honored to officially welcome you and call you a member of the family. Before I read, let me say it's um, 30 years ago <clears throat> this year that I first met and got to know Genesis the boy. I cannot tell you how proud I am of Genesis the man and I wish you both every happiness. Daniel Miltras spoke again and said, and what of marriage, master? And he answered saying, you are born together and together you shall be forevermore. You shall be together when the white wings of death scatter your days. Aye, you shall be together even in the silent memory of God. Claire came into my life as a teenager and has spent roughly the same time with her mum and I as she has we have that. And I hope that we all have had some input into the wonderful young lady we see here today. As you have done from the day you were born, you made your dad a very happy and proud man. I love you with all my heart and wish nothing but the best things for you in my life with Jen. And now, ladies and gentlemen, that leads us nicely onto the central part of today's ceremony. They will begin by exchanging vows which they have chosen themselves. Firstly, Genesis, can you please repeat after me? Claire, I promise to be your friend and partner. Claire, I promise to be your friend and partner. And to walk beside you always. And to walk beside you always. To love you with all that I am. To love you with all that I am. To support, respect and share with you. To support, respect and share with you. In all of life's decisions. In all of life's decisions. Through joy and sadness. Through joy and sadness. Triumph and uncertainty. Triumph and uncertainty. Laughter and tears. Laughter and tears. To have you in my life every day for as long as we live. To have you in my life every day for as long as we live. And now, Claire, can you please repeat after me? Genesis, I promise to be your friend and partner. Genesis, I, 
I promise to be your friend and partner. And to walk beside you always. And to walk beside you always. To love you with all that I am. To love you with all that I am. To support, respect and share with you. To support, respect and share with you. To support, respect and share with you. In all of life's decisions. In all of life's decisions. Through joy and sadness. Through joy and sadness. Triumph and uncertainty. Triumph and uncertainty. Laughter and tears. Laughter and tears. To have you in my life every day for as long as we live. To have you in my life every day for as long as we live. And so, Genesis and Claire, following the binding declaration you have made before me and in the presence of your guests and witnesses, it gives me the greatest pleasure in declaring you married and pronouncing you husband and wife. Genesis, you may now kiss your wife. <laughs> <laughs> Claire, Jesus, what a start. <laughs> aye, there's no doubt I'm punching above my weight, but aye, she had good crying. <laughs> And so, ladies and gentlemen, although we all know why we are here today, this ceremony gives us the ideal opportunity to look back and remind ourselves of the events that have brought Genesis and Claire to this very significant point in their lives. First of all, I think it is fair to say that Genesis and Claire haven't exactly rushed into getting married. It is, after all, 12 years since they started going out together, and I'm sure some of you here today were beginning to think this day might never come. I'm told by Claire and Jen that today wouldn't have happened if it wasn't for me. That is their words, their words the other day, I'm telling you. Just over 12 years ago, it was a Friday night I think it was, he wasn't sure what he was going to go stalking that night. <laughs> and I suggested I could drop him off at Ech Marquee. So I was meant to give him a lift home, but I never heard back from him. And this was the night that Claire, uh, Jen got Claire back to Cool House. And from that point, they have never looked back. I've had a truly amazing 12 years with this woman, and it feels like 12 weeks. It's just been flying. We've never looked back. We've had some great times together, and I'm a lucky boy, I know that. And that's all I've got to say about Claire. <laughs> <laughs> what can I say? When Jen finally decided he was going to ask Claire to marry him, he pulled me up to one side at the house in Lomfarnan and led me to the garage. Right, he stood behind his quad bike where I heard the words, What do you think of this, man? <laughs> I wondered for a split second what he was actually trying to show me <laughs> as he was half concealed by a quad bike. <laughs> then he pulled out a small package and he added, do you think she'll like this? <laughs> Clearly he'd been a busy man and had been away bought a ring. I was totally blown away. I had no idea whatsoever that he was away to ask Claire's hand in marriage. It wasn't so much the words that he used, it was more the way he asked me. It brought a lump to my throat, a tear to my eye, and I was actually shaking. I had no hesitation in agreeing to him marrying the daughter. And that seemed to work, because he stopped pointing the gun at me and put it down. <laughs> And afterwards, I think we kind of man-hugged it out a little, didn't we? Something like that, wasn't it? And then got pissed, so... <laughs> He's a bozy. Genesis, please place Claire's ring on the third finger of her left hand as you repeat the following declaration after me. I, Genesis, accept you, Claire, in marriage. I, Genesis, accept you, Claire, in marriage. To be my lawfully wedded wife. To be my lawfully wedded wife. I, Claire, accept you, Genesis, in marriage. I, Claire, accept you, Genesis, in marriage. To be my lawfully wedded husband. To be my lawfully wedded husband. So, if we could all be upstanding for the newlyweds, a happy married couple. 
Mr. and Mrs. Rosen. in Genesis. May your love for each other and your willingness to accept each other in sickness and in health and in joy and in sadness cement the foundation for a strong and lasting marriage. Share your thoughts, experiences and dreams with each other and cherish the intimacy and understanding that comes with the passage of time. Marriage is the coming together for better or for worse. Let your love grow deeper, truer and more generous to the very end of your lives and may your marriage go deeper and stronger as the years go by.